good morning guys it is Arika Misha and today I am cooking like a little mini seafood bake so because it ain't a seafood boil but I'm gonna put everything in my pan and put some garlic butter over it and put it in the oven seafood bake whatever y'all want to call it all right so let me get everything out I've got everything out pretty much um, and the garlic butter that I'm going to use is the Kerrygold garlic butter. Um, it's the garlic butter. It's like, you know, butter with garlic already in it. I like getting this because it's quick and easy and simple. Um, so I have two of those. I'm going to melt this down to pour over my food. So, all right, let me show you guys. All right, we've got, as you guys can see, I've got my corn on the cob. The little short corn on the cob. I've got my sausage. All right. <clears throat> and now I've already prepped all this. I did all this last night, prepped everything. And that's what I do. When I know I'm doing like a seafood boil, I always prep everything the day before. That makes it quick and easier for me. I just prep one day and the next day throw it all in the pan. So I've got my eggs all nice and boiled here. And I've got my shrimp in the back, all nice and seasoned and marinated. So, got my raw shrimp, it's the jumbo shrimp, uh, my boiled eggs, uh, my uh, beef kielbasa sausage, that's what I use. Um, sometimes I use a spicy sausage, but sometimes the girls don't really like spicy. So, and you guys are gonna see, I'm just gonna go ahead. Now the first thing I do is I go ahead, I like to pan fry my sausage. So it gets like a nice little buttery crisp to it. I like that. Um, so let me go ahead because I've already got my pan over here ready. So let's go over here to the stove. As you guys see, I've already got my butter all hot over here. It's waiting on the sausage, on the sausages. So let me get those in there. Just put a little butter in the pan. That's all I did. And I'm just going to... Uh, pan fry these. Get them all nice and brown. And I like to get my sausage cooked first. So we've got the sausage that's gonna go ahead, and I'm gonna get that all nice and golden brown for us. Um. I'm going to also get my garlic butter melted. Let me get my pot out for that. You guys will see how I do that. It's easy. I'm not doing anything but putting the butter. Putting my butter in here. We're going to let those sausages get a little brown on that side. Let me take you guys over here to my pot where my garlic butter is going to go. Make sure you guys are zoomed in to see that. Okay. So, got my stove on. Go ahead and get my butter opened up. I love this garlic butter. It is really good. Only like two dollars and forty-five cents at Publix. I love it. Your garlic, everything's already in there for you. All I do is just melt it down and pour it over the food. Y'all know how I do it, quick and easy. So it just melts down real quick. Get those two in there. We is doing this. It's not gonna take our butter long to melt down. Let that melt real quick. Melt down butter. Go back over here to these sausages. Get our sausages flipped over. See, quick and easy. That butter, I've got it at a medium uh, high heat. I don't, you don't need a high heat. So, got that butter in there. That butter going to help them get all nice and juicy and brown. Cut my butter down over here. 
that butter melts real quick. And I like I like making it quick and easy, guys. I don't like being in the kitchen all day. I'm in here enough. Y'all see, I, I put up a lot of cooking videos because I'm always in the kitchen cooking for the family. That's what we do. That's what we women do. We get it done. So. Alright, so I'm going to finish. Go ahead and get these sausages. Uh, finish getting them brown, guys. They almost finished anyway. About another minute. Um, and as you guys see, our garlic butter is melting over there. That garlic butter smells so good. Alright, let me go ahead and get these two finished. And then I'll be back to show you guys how I'm going to build this and stick it in the oven. Okay, guys. I am ready to go ahead and um, build my seafood bake. So, let's get ready. Alright, the first thing I'm going to do, I am going to put a little bit of my uh, garlic butter. I'm going to put a little bit of that garlic butter at the bottom. Get that all spread it around in my pan. So there's some garlic butter at the bottom. Get that all juiced around and get the bottom all nice and buttery. All right, so we got a little bit at the bottom. So let's go ahead and start building. All right, I like putting my corn on the cob in. I like putting that around the sides. I've already got my corn all cleaned up, washed up. See, and this pan is perfect. I like just putting everything, putting my corn on the side here. All right, so we've got that. And let's go ahead and add some eggs. Go ahead and add some of my eggs in there. Let's throw some of our shrimp in there, guys. Get some of that shrimp at the bottom. Okay, so we got some shrimp down in there. Let me move that out the way. Get my hands washed. Let's get some sausage in here. Sausage is hot, hot, hot because we just cooked that. And I like getting the butter and the juices that the sausage cooked in. I like getting that in there too. Oh, so good. Adds flavor. Adds so much flavor. All right. Get that in there. All right. Make sure you got everything in here all nice and good. Okay, so we got some sausage in there. We'll save the rest of that sausage. So let's go ahead and put some eggs in here. And I'll just kind of put the eggs around in the corner. I usually cook a whole full dozen of eggs. So let's just get some eggs around here. Eggs on the side. One over there, one over there. Oh yeah, it's coming together. And then let's get some shrimp in here. You can get some more sausage. We'll get the rest of that sausage in here. Oh yeah. And this does not take long to cook, guys. I've got my oven preheated at um, 400. Got my oven preheated at 400 degrees. And um. I'm going to cover it with aluminum foil. Sometimes I cover it with aluminum foil and sometimes I don't. But I am going to go ahead and cover this. I'm sorry. Let me zoom you guys in. So you guys can see better. Sorry about that, guys. Let me zoom y'all in to the goodness. Yes. So. Today, I'm going to go ahead and cover it with aluminum foil today. Okay, we got all of that goodness in. Okay, and let's get the rest of our sausage. And then we'll add that garlic butter on top. Oh. 
Oh yeah, that looks real good. And when those shrimps get done, they get all nice and pretty and pink. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be real good. Get it all pretty. I'm telling you, nothing like a little seafood bake. That's what I call it, seafood bake. So, let's get our garlic butter all stirred up here. Let's get that all stirred up and get ready to get that poured on. Okay. All right, so you guys can see. Okay. I usually start in the middle and then just work my way out. Make sure my eggs get some of that garlic butter on them. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Yes. Yes, that smells so good. Ooh, I'm ready to eat it right now, y'all know. I am ready to eat it right now. Pouring that on all our corn. Everybody getting all that garlic and butter. Look at that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's gonna be good. Y'all know that's gonna be good. Let me get y'all over here. Get y'all zoomed in. Look at it. The corn, the eggs, the sausage, the shrimp. And wait until those shrimps get all nice and pretty and pink. It's gonna give it more color and make it look more good. Well, whatever, y'all know what I mean. So let me go ahead, get it in the oven, guys. And next thing y'all gonna see, y'all gonna see the bake all nice and done. I'll be back, guys. Okay, I'm getting ready to take my seafood bake out of the oven. I think it's been in there long enough. I had it at 400 degrees and I had it in there for 30 minutes. Oh yeah, oh that looks amazing. Oh, I love those eggs. Hold on y'all, I know I'm gonna bring y'all around. Make sure y'all can get a nice, hot, hot. Ooh, nice of you to take y'all in to all the goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh Lord Jesus, thank you God. Thank you God, we are so thankful. Mm, mm, mm. Look at this. We got those nice boiled eggs covered in that garlic butter. We got the sausage. I I, I just gotta take y'all in. Y'all can't see good enough. Look, look at this. Look at this. We got the shrimp, the sausage. Y'all see the corn? Ooh, look at that corn peeking out. Ooh, wee. Goodness gracious. Mm mm mm. Look at those sausages all. Now mind you, remember we already roasted and buttered up the sausages, so y'all know they good. They are garlicky, garlicky buttered. Yeah, y'all know what I mean. Tastes like garlic and butter. They all ready. Anyway, y'all seen it? Y'all seen me do it? So y'all know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha, guys. Let me take it back out so y'all can see all the goodness. One more, one more shot before I leave. I'm gonna let y'all see. Let's, let's zoom into them eggs. Look at, look at the eggs. The garlic butter. Ooh. Ooh, look at it. And come on, y'all. Y'all can fix this. Uh, a dozen of eggs. How cheap is eggs? Eggs, a dollar and some change for a dozen of eggs. Sausages. The sausage is about $3. The shrimp. Get a bag of shrimp for $15. Get a pack of corn for $3. Come on, y'all. That's it. And some butter. You can do regular butter if you want. Or uh, the garlic butter was only $2. I mean, come on, y'all. I don't even think that's... Y'all. That's that's a cheap. Y'all can do this meal. Nice, quick, easy meal. And it's not even expensive. Don't let the shrimp fool you. Alright, guys. Bye. Don't forget. Oh, I'm sorry. I gotta I gotta make sure I say. Don't forget, knowledge is power. Bye guys.